one life physician to rule them all, discover my precious and how it makes you a better martial artist without having to walk into Mortal. Welcome back to Dojo at Home. I'm Sensei Wen from the University Karate Center. In our martial arts style, we learn a number of kicks. If you're just starting, make it. Looks familiar. That's the straight kick. As you progress, you'll learn Mawashige. It's your roundhouse kick. Then we have Yokuge. Think of this as your thrusting kick. That means it pushes or stops someone. There's a lot of power in it. Trust me. And since this is about our non-spinning kicks, we finish with Kegigeri. Yes, there are others, and some of them also work with this tip. So, what is this magical leg skin? We call it the universal chain. It's a position you can hold where you're equally able to do most of your kicks. In other words, your opponent won't know what you're going to do until you've already thrown the kick. How does it work? Great question. First, let's make sure we're all stretched out. We want to be limber while practicing, so we can get the most range and avoid getting hurt. Ready? Great. So, a universal chamber comes off of the chamber for most of your kids. If you've already learned Mawashigiri, maybe you've learned Okugiri, maybe you've also learned Kagigiri, then this will look familiar. If you've only learned one or two of them, you can still use it to interchange. So in this case, we're going to look at Mawashigiri, Yokugiri, and Kagigiri. So again, Mawashigiri, Yokugiri, Kagigiri. Well, wait a minute. I was just in the same spot for all of those. So a universal chamber is when we bring our knee up when we bring it out, we pivot, and we point our knee forward. Now, from here, I can flip my leg out into a moshigiri. I can curl it around into a kegigiri, and I can pull my knee back and thrust out into a yokugiri. So from the side, here's what that looks like. It'd be one, two, three. So, universal chamber, once again, one, two, three. Knee out, like chambered in. Now, if you're leaning towards a yoga giddy, side kick, you can kind of turn it in as you make the foot position. If you're doing kegi and moshi giddy, kind of keep the foot the way it is, because it'll work for both. Okay, great. Whether elf, hobbit, or human, you can use the universal chamber to practice getting faster and stronger kicks while keeping your opponent guessing. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel, follow us on Facebook, and get your training videos from our website. Also, we're open. Come and train. Check our online schedule for any modifications. Until next time, I'm Sensei Wynn from the University Karate Center.